Hey YouTube, Mike here. I've got a question to ask you, but before I do, I want to tell you something. Today was the perfect, I saw the perfect example of why you should always carry a camera with you. Today was my son's birthday. He's 18. And uh, he lives about an hour drive from me. So I was going to where his birthday party was. And on my way up I-40, which is the highway, I saw a pig, a big giant porker of a pig, walking down the road. And behind him was a cop, just chasing the hell out of him. <laughs> it was funny as everything. Well, I get five miles up the road, and there's this big tractor trailer like thing with its uh, door open. And several pigs were laying, running around the highway, and one of them was dead. But no other, but there's no other cops or uh, animal control officers around. And this one little guy, he was just chasing these pigs around, had cars stopped everywhere. I don't know how that door got him, but it was funny. It's everything watching those pigs run around. Anyway, my son's birthday party. He's 18. We had it at Hooters. Yes, I know. That's where he wanted it, so that's where we went. It was, that's, that's where his mother took him. It was me, my son, his, my son's girlfriend, my ex's sister, my ex, her husband were there. So here's the question I've got to ask you. Now that my son is 18, should I let him drink a beer? Now in North Carolina, the drinking age is 21 for both beer and liquor. When I was 18, about 10 years ago or so, uh, okay, when I was 18, many, many years ago, Drinking age for beer was 18, and hard liquor was 19, 21. So, my son is much more mature than I was at that age. And, and in some respects, probably much more mature than I am now. But anyway, would it be wrong for me to buy him a beer at home and let him drink some? Good question, isn't it? I mean, what does three years make I mean would three years made a difference with me no I was drinking beer at 17 16 and I'm sure he has no problem getting it either so answer that question would it be wrong for me to buy him a beer thanks for watching have a nice day and hey don't forget the grape juice ah uh, I thought I'd give you an update on the pigs after I'd left the uh, Hooters and was going back down I-40 to go home, traffic was blocked up on both both sides of the highway because of the pigs. Uh, animal control was out there, so were the cops, and they were still round, winding them up, winding them up, rounding them up. So everything's all right. The dead pig's still on the highway. So now I'm gone. And again, don't forget the grape juice. Bye.